Hi, I'm Kristen Vogel, Library Director here at the Mulva Library at St. Norbert College. And welcome to the Mulva Studio, which is about ready to open for the students' return. So it's great to get a sneak peek before you come back to campus of what this space is. You get a hint of it from the walls behind me. This graphic, powerful entrance. You've got the mind, the gears of the mind working, forward progress. You've got the balance with our tradition of faith, so faith and reason working together to build development. Over here on this wall as you walk in, you've also got this great blue, which is a symbol of reflection and contemplation. So that ties really well into our Norbertine heritage as well, where you want to be both contemplative and action-oriented, neither one to the exclusion of the other one. Let's take a look around. So over here, we've got a conference table. A small group can get together. Uh, working in this space, the table is able to be written upon with dry erase markers. It's got the slide out tray, so if you lean back a little bit as you're working together, you can really get comfortable but still have your materials right accessible. The wall that we've got here shows uh, flight progress. Our donor, uh, Mr. Mulva, and his family are very much into aviation, so it's a nod and appreciation of their gift to be able to enable us to do this, as well as reinforcing that notion that you're really trying to learn and build what we know and take it forward into the future. Back over here behind you, you'll find that there is a digital coffee table. This particular piece is a very exciting high-tech piece that we've got here in the library that we're adding. So right now it's loading up a solar system interaction uh, piece. You're gonna be able to use it as a regular Windows-based computer, so to do all the regular office suite things with touch capability. And then you're also gonna be able to put together your own educational exhibits. And for those programmers among you, you're gonna be able to do C++ programming for apps in this particular area. So the television studio moved over from another place on campus. It's the recording set for the conversations at St. Norbert College. Fantastic show about bringing the big ideas, big picture issues in the world locally for our own conversation. It fits perfectly with this particular space. And in addition, now students, you're gonna be able to use the space for your own video recording and your own uh, creation of how to put together information visually through film and then be able to think about what kind of power that has. So in this space, you start to be in a small cluster, just you or a couple of people who get together to study and that. And you can actually write on this wall so you can make your notes together. Visual learning at its best, action and the visual image. So another piece of hard working space for academics and for your learning is a setup like this where you can come together with a group who are working on a project. You've got two monitors here so that you're able to be able to project multiple images at the same time. And down inside this particular case, there are multiple attachment points. So up to four people can bring their devices in. You can bring an Android phone, an iPad, a Mac laptop, a PC laptop, and you can all connect two different images projecting at a time. Someone else is sitting there doing some of the background research, figuring out what it is that needs to come next. It says, I'm ready, let me show you the, the group this. And you tap on the puck and it's gonna switch whose image is shown from their particular uh, device. There are some times when you are gonna be stretched out reading for an extended period of time. So these chairs are perfect for it and they've got these neat tables right with it. They can be either like this with a bench where you can actually have somebody drop down beside you and chat for a minute, or up like this where when the chair is up in the higher position, you're ready to set your coffee for meds and your book right beside you. We heard loud and clear from students when the library opened that they wanted even more study space than there was already. And so we listened to you over the last year, student surveys, student focus groups, talking to us about what you wanted. You wanted space to spread out. You wanted space that felt comfortable, but not too comfortable. And so the furniture design people came in and talked to us about the multiple types of furniture that they recommended. Things at counter height, things at table height, and each of those you find in the space. So we think you're gonna be really comfortable, but not too comfortable. All right, so you've had some hints of the space. It's ready for the students to use. We want you to come in here, use it to its fullest. If you've got questions about the space, come up to the main desk on the first floor. Let us know what your thoughts are. We're gonna be asking what works, what doesn't work, so we can respond and adapt to those things. Come down, get comfortable, spread out, work it to its fullest. Have a great year.